Hi guys, it's Toddy here at CES 2020 and we are checking out the OnePlus One, not really a booth, but a room. The company isn't actually launching anything at this year's Consumer Electronics Show, but it is showing off a concept device, which it is calling this, the Concept One. Now this phone, on first glance on the front especially, looks and feels just like any other recent OnePlus 7 or 7T flagship. It's got the same uh, edge to edge display as you can see and the same kind of rounded back. Obviously the back is where the biggest difference lies. The main hook here is this little element you can see in the middle. So what this is, is it looks like a continuous piece of just black glass set between real leather back. It's papaya orange leather. We'll talk about where that comes from in a second. Now the hook with this phone, or this concept phone I should say, is that this is electrochromic glass. The main uh, crux being that when I launch the camera here, you can actually see the glass fades and the cameras come into view. It's the same camera arrangement as the phones you can buy right now. This phone won't actually necessarily be on sale, but it's OnePlus flexing its muscles, if you will, showing what it might be bringing to the table in future iterations. Now, we're not expecting to see this sort of technology on the next, on the OnePlus 8 or the OnePlus 8T. Maybe on a special edition, this is built in partnership with McLaren, which is something the company has done for a few generations now, as you can even see just down here with the OnePlus McLaren logo and also that papaya orange leather that I mentioned is pulled straight from the uh, British racing car company's top cars. This phone is apparently based on the 750 Spider, so their new convertible, more affordable, if you can call such a thing, a McLaren affordable uh, car. But that's really the crux of what this, this device shows. It's OnePlus flexing its muscles, highlighting that what we might be able to see in future iterations. Now, obviously, you could see this technology expand maybe something like the entire back of the device changing color, something like that. This is born out of what the company is calling its CMF Design Initiative, which stands for Color, Materials and Finishes, which is exactly why you have this premium look here. Beyond that though, there's not a lot to say. This phone is a lovely looking device, but it's not something we're gonna see anytime soon. Instead, just get excited for the OnePlus 8. There's already plenty of stuff online about that. I'm sure we've got stuff on the site you can check out right now and stay tuned for more, both at CES and in general. See you soon.